Siam Square is one of Bangkok's most beautiful landmark. After visiting nearby famous shopping malls, come here at the weekends to enjoy some events, live music bands, and of course, the incredible atmosphere. Hello everyone. Tonight I'm at the Siam Square again. And the last video was three and four months ago, but I'm going to show you Sun Square again tonight because there's just so much going on. Um, as you can see already, probably can hear from the immense loud music and all the announcements. So let's go check out Sun Square. Um, one thing to remind you guys is if you want this kind of atmosphere, then you definitely have to come during the weekends. For example, Friday evening, Saturday night, or Sunday night. And you're going to find a lot of these very young Thai dance groups. That's why when you come to Times Square these days, you're going to feel, oh, Actually, all the shopping malls like Siam Paragon, Siam Square One and Siam Centre, you're going to find a lot of young people because they are attracted to Siam Square, you know, with all the dance groups, uh, live music groups, and over here we've got a basketball event. So it looks like it will happen from 30th of September to the 2nd of October. So there's just so much stuff going on. I'm not sure if you can even hear me before the loudspeakers going on. But uh, this you could, if you come this weekend, I'm gonna try to upload this as fast as possible. You can play in a ball ring. Not bad, uh, 63 seconds. That's probably the best I've seen people do on the ball ring. But we're gonna walk down there now. As you can see, there's so much stuff going on. That's why I have to make this video. Let's go check out the other stuff. That's why I think this is going to be one of the hottest spots in the entire Bangkok for years to come. They put a lot of money into rebuilding it. It looks fantastic now. Uh, some people even say it looks kind of like Seoul in Korea and Tokyo in Japan. Not only if they put a lot of money into reconstructing, redesigning the street, but they always host different kinds of events. And this one is a scooter ring where you can have a scooter race. Yep, you can see the scooters here. I'm not sure how much it costs, but you can rent one and have a race inside this scooter ring. The atmosphere is great, right? Uh, the street looks fantastic. There's so much, so many people here. Really enjoyable visiting Times Square. Where it was good before COVID, but now I think it's even better. Not only it looks great, but the atmosphere is great. Everyone's here is having fun. Uh, looks like this kind of a uh, fitness event here. Uh, Jets 24 Hour Fitness, one of the biggest kind of gym uh, branch in Thailand, in Bangkok and Thailand. Not quite sure what's going on here. I think it's a mini concert, but... Uh, Got some boxing bags in the boxing ring. I think you can actually pay to have a spa with one of the fighters. 
I'm not sure, I can't re I'm really read Thai, but I think that's what it says. 500 baht for, I don't know, a mini concert and a fight. But at the moment, not too many people interested. And of course, um, if you're into, you know, the market, you know, street vendors, uh, on both sides of the, that's the Siam Square One shopping mall, and on this side, and I think on the other side as well, it's kind of like a market. So if you like street vendors, you want to buy clothes or fashion accessories, or some street food, you can check out these outdoor markets. Really, really good atmosphere here. This is one of the, if you walk down the street, you're gonna see so many people taking selfies, Instagram posts. Looks like this one is a kind of a, a photographic booth. It's, that's really popular in Thailand. It looks like we're approaching another live music band. Very, very popular during the weekends. Um, you can see a lot of youngsters attracted to these kind of live bands. But I think uh, three months ago, this really new amazing looking shopping mall was kind of I say 60 to 70 percent occupied but right now it's fully occupied it looks amazing but don't ask me who this band is I have no idea on uh, Thai music but it seems like quite a popular band there's loads of people here We're at the end of Siam Square now. Uh, hopefully, I've shown you how great this uh, attraction is, this landmark is during the weekends. But of course, apart from the street, there's uh, plenty of food, plenty of restaurants. That's the Siam Scape, uh, kind of a shopping center, half business center kind of thing. And this concert arena here, there's plenty of events hosted every single week, but uh, not occupied tonight. And right across us, the really uh, colorful, bright shopping mall is the famous MPK shopping mall. So uh, apart from the main MPK street, you should also check out these side streets, plenty of um, really trendy fashion clothes shops and uh, restaurants. But it looks fantastic right now, right? For anyone that um, remembers the old Siam Square, very popular back then, but it looks completely different, right? So if you're coming to Bangkok, definitely recommend spending a night in the Siam area, you know, in Siam Paragon, in uh, Siam Square One, and the beautiful Siam Square Street. And later on, you can head into MBK Shopping Mall for a perfect night. But again, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video, see you in the next one.